welcome to another video i know it's been so long since i posted on youtube and thank you so much to everyone that's been sending messages asking how i'm doing and you know what's been going on i will update you guys <laughs> and i'm so sorry about that but i'm currently at Birawa beach in chengdu as you guys can see it's a nice day sunny and breezy which is why i'm here I went to have breakfast this morning at this little place called Secret Spot, which was really nice. I had pancakes. It's actually a vegan place, which is very filling. And I decided to just come to the beach, chill, have a nice Saturday. It's Saturday, by the way. So I have a nice little Saturday with a sunny, beautiful view. So to update you guys about what's been going on and why I haven't posted. First of all, you know, I feel like there wasn't much for me to share anymore like I had I was basically doing the same thing every day so I didn't feel like it was entertaining personally and I didn't feel creative enough to film it and then number two Ralph got sick he got COVID like I think a couple maybe like a month ago because I think it's been over a month since I have uploaded and it was a lot to deal with <laughs> because I was basically taking care of him a lot so I just didn't feel like filming we thought he had dengue fever and then it ended up being just COVID which was really an interesting story in its own also Magic Years the, comp the ESL company I talked to you guys about their bookings went down dramatically I actually just made a video to update you guys about this so if you want to check it out you know, check it out right here but with that like so many of these things were happening all at once so I just didn't feel like uploading um, but I feel so grateful. I had so many comments from you guys asking, you know, how we're doing? Is everything okay? So thank you so much for checking up on me. And on another note, we have been living here in Bali now. I think it's been a year now, a little over a year, like a year and one month. And some people had asked me, do I feel like a logo now? And I'm like, no. <laughs> I mean, I don't speak the language. And overall, I feel like I know Bali like I feel like if you take me anywhere in Chengdu I feel familiar with it so I feel like I'm comfortable here and apparently the tourism the government here is trying to create a digital nomad visa I don't know if you guys have seen that it's not final I'm hoping it comes up soon but apparently if it does pass it should give you about five years to live in Bali as a digital nomad which is insane how cool would that be i feel like so many people will be able to come here and decide to stay long term enjoy maybe go back home but you'll have the ability to do back and forth it will be so cool for you guys to be able to experience this as well like i hope many countries do that because it's it's really nice to be able to experience it for a little bit and then have a field and then go back home and see if there's something you want to do long term so yeah that's a little bit of an update for you guys I'm going to chill here, watch the surfers. You guys are seeing the surfers here, enjoying the waves. And I'm actually gonna go in the water too because I had a bit of a cold for the past week and I'm much better now, but I need that because seawater is actually very good if you, you know, have a cold. So I wanna go dip in a little bit, relax, and enjoy the Saturday. And be responsible. Oh. But I need to go again. Good morning everyone. Today is Monday. Yesterday we ended up going to the movies with a bunch of friends. I completely forgot to bring my camera and I tried to film with my phone. But we went to the movies to see Thor and so many of my friends were obsessed with this movie let me know if you guys are obsessed with it too i feel like marvel now to me it's very predictable that's what i probably don't like about it i like the action and the quality the sci-fi and to me is just top as far as quality but i feel like the story is they need they need to improve the stories i feel like it's not special like you know what's going to happen you have an expectation so it doesn't make you feel like you're getting something new and exciting it to me but at the sci-fi so far is great if you guys also watch thor let me know what you guys think because to me i felt like it was okay am i the only one <laughs> so yeah that was yesterday during the day and then in the evening we went to play games we have a group of friends that we play games that i think i told you guys that before we went and played some uno i played this new game called pandemic i don't know if you guys ever heard of it 
there's so many board games out there literally i want to encourage you guys to buy some and don't watch tv so much just try to spend time with your family doing that i know for sure when i'm going back home i'm gonna buy some board games and play with my family like Catan, like settlers of Catan, is a is a cool game that ralph is obsessed with i love uno there's also this game pandemic where the goal here was to end a pandemic like it's a very interesting game because instead of you being opposed to people what you're doing is you're playing with your crew to solve the problem and to end the pandemic i think that's pretty cool i like more cooperative games like that i don't like when it's like i mean i like the competitive spirit of you know you're the winner i'm the loser kind of thing but i really like the idea of you know us being collaborative in a way i feel like that could teach a lot of people to work together versus working against each other you know what i mean i guess what i like about it more is that there's no like i win you lose there's more like we all win and for the greater cause if that makes sense yeah i want to find more games like that if you guys know any more board games like this i'd love to know more so let me know in the comments as well but yeah so that was yesterday today i have a couple of things to do however the weather is not looking the best right now I don't know what's been going on this summer but you can't predict your day at all like you might wake up and see that it's sunny and you have plans to go to the beach and then by two o'clock it's like the complete opposite so yeah summer in bali has been a bit different <laughs> but yeah today i have a couple of things to do i want to first get organized i love to do like monday organization so if you guys want to follow along i'm going to leave a link to the self-made planner which is a planner that i created that i'm using currently and it's helping me so so much i love it i feel like to me it helps me separate my priorities from my to-do list and it's very clear and precise because a lot of the time i feel like there's certain things that are important and they're not important but you just put them all together in a to-do list and you just try to do the things that's the easiest and then nothing else gets done so i feel like this one helps me really clean out my mind space and do it well it's really been giving me a lot of clarity so i'm gonna work on that first and then get the day started so let's go I'm gonna start the day today's monday i'm gonna start with my daily affirmation write my today's priorities and then my other to do's list and then i love the time blocking section that allows me to stay focused on my task and basically know exactly what time you're supposed to do them for example today i'm gonna focus from 9 to 10 on this course that i'm taking so i have to learn a little bit for 9 to 10 and then i need to focus on editing my youtube video so i'm gonna do a little bit between 10 to 12 and i want to make sure that i schedule my lunch because if not i will not have lunch and the rest of the day i might go through some emails and also finish editing the youtube video and then i have some notes here if i have any reminders for the end of the day and then i always end the day with gratitude which is awesome to me so if you guys want to check this out there will be a link in the description box so it's a little bit later i was basically working most of the day this vlog today may not be what you guys expected it's just me telling you why i haven't been basically uploading as much but also showing you guys the process of basically coming back so if you ever if you guys have ever been in a situation where you stopped doing something for a while you got lazy or maybe you know life happened like the pandemic and so on and you have to go back to what you used to do and it's a bit difficult um i definitely feel you <laughs> because that's what i've been going through and also trying to identify what i'm supposed to do next i think it's been a bit of a great period for me where i'm trying to figure out do i want to go in this direction career-wise i want to go here and it's been a bit blurry for the past year to be honest because i had such a set vision on what i wanted to do and then life happens and you have to change that plan now so changing that plan is like that's when you have to figure out what it is but at the same time i always learned that on the opposite side of this struggle is what you truly want because i know i was going as a at a good pace but it wasn't the ultimate thing that i wanted to do so pushing yourself like when you go through adversity when you go through something that's not what you expected when you push through that and you figure out okay how can i get to where i want to go and how can i push that that's the part that is difficult but it's the work that needs to happen so i'm all constantly telling myself that because i know everything happens for a reason so no matter what i'm going through i try to remind myself that 
all of this is happening so that you can be where you want to be in the future if that makes sense so i think i'm gonna leave you guys with that message i will be coming out with great new videos for sure just please bear with me um, I want to go back to how I used to do in Vietnam, which is, you know, good lifestyle videos and also content videos that may help you guys. But that's the direction I want to go and I want to make it very clear. I don't want to give you guys just random content here and there where you're like, what is going on? So please stick with me, subscribe, and also comment down below what videos you guys want me to do. Okay, bye guys.